Hi there everyone, welcome back. It's been a while since I've posted anything. We have a new puppy and she has been taking a lot of my time. Anyway, I'm back and this month's goal is to post some fabulous February 15 minute videos. So today's video will be a 15 minute flow meant for just lubricating the body, opening it up. Um, if you've been a little bit tired and you don't want a heavy workout, you just want to feel like you can get your joints moving again, this is for you. All right, so let's get started. Coming to hands and knees, please. Hands are going to start under the shoulders, knees are going to be under the hips. We're going to just start out with a simple cat-cow. Curl your toes under, push the floor away as you round the spine as you exhale. Mm. Inhale, you lengthen the tail, draw the shoulders wide and extend. And we'll do that again. Press the floor away as you exhale and round. Inhale, lengthen and extend. And exhale, press the floor away, press into the toes. Inhale, lengthen. And then go ahead and take one hand and flip your wrist if it feels good, any amount. Same thing, cat cow the spine, press the floor away. Inhale, stretch it up. You'll feel a little bit different. Go ahead, slowly peel that hand away. Place it back down, switch. Other hand flips around, press the floor away. And inhale, extend and lengthen. Then again, just peel that hand away. And one more here, just with both hands in the regular position, lengthen out. Beautiful, let's step the left foot back into a plank position, shift a little bit forward and backwards, feeling a little, maybe a bit of a stretch through the foot, through the calf. Good, find a neutral. Let's take that right hand towards the side of the head, push away from the floor as you breathe in. You can twist your body. As you exhale, you're gonna just curl, bring the elbow towards the opposite elbow. Breathe in, press the floor away, open the chest, the hips will turn, and twist in. Let's go again, breathe in, and breathe out. Two more on this side. Breathe in, and breathe out. Last one, breathe in, get long through the spine, breathe out. And then from here, you're gonna just place that hand down, bring your knee down, switch to the other side. Right foot steps back, and again, a little bit of a lean forward and back, please. Stretching through the calf, and maybe feeling a little bit stretched through the toes, any amount that feels good. And then find a neutral position, left hand towards the head. Inhale, open and twist. Exhale, curl in. Inhale, open and twist. Exhale, curl in. Inhale, open and twist. Exhale, curl in. We'll do two more here. Inhale, press the floor away. Exhale. And one more time, breathe in. And breathe out. Bring that hand down, bring your knee down. Good. From here, you're gonna bring your hands a little bit farther forward. Send your hips back as far as it's comfortable. Round your spine forward so you come into a plank on your knees. Shoulders draw back. A little bit of extension here, breathe in. Pull the belly in, shift back, exhale. And round forward. It's like you're cat cowing again with a little more extension. And then pull the belly in as you cinch back. And wave forward. Shoulders draw together on your back body. And back, almost like a down dog, up dog but we're just staying on the knees. Let's just do one more like that over the, just make sure your hands are under your shoulders or a little bit farther forward. Good. From here, you're gonna walk your hands towards your knees till you build up on top of your knees. Good. From here, balancing, stepping your left foot forward, we're gonna just send the hips forward. Let's inhale, sink the hips down, so feel a little opening through the front of the hip. Exhale, just send your body back, stretching over the front leg any amount. Bend into that front knee, breathe in, and breathe out, just fold forward. And breathe in, hips sink, 
Breathe out. We'll do two more like that. Breathe in and breathe out. And one more time. Breathing in and breathing out. Coming forward once again. This time we'll build the, bring the hands up on top of the knee, build the spine up. Get really tall, pull the belly in, feel the connectivity between the inner legs. Let's just take both arms up as you inhale. Exhale, squeeze the shoulder blades together on your back body. Do that two more times. Breathe in and breathe out. One more time, breathe in. Breathe out. Arms open to the side. Twist towards that bent knee, the left leg, and reach hands in two directions. One more breath here. Good, face back to the front. Hands come down. Just take that left foot back. Good, you're gonna bring your hands down. We're gonna bring the feet in a nice plank position here, the legs. Send your hips up and back, a nice stretch through the back body and down dog here. Pedal your feet for a moment. Take one more breath here. Exhale, just slowly with control, lower the knees down. Walk your hands back. Build your body up. We're going to step that right foot forward now. Right foot comes forward. Bringing the hands down to the mat. Finding that nice stretch through the left hip. Inhale here. The chest is broad. Exhale, folding forward over that straight leg any amount. You can use blocks here under your hands. I forgot to mention that. Breathe in and breathe out. Breathe in, hips sink forward. Breathe out, take the body back. Breathe in, sink the hips forward, should feel really good. And stretch it back, any amount. Let's go for two more here, breathing in and breathing out. This is definitely my tighter side. And one more time, inhale, and exhale, stretch it back. Now we're gonna come forward once again here. Let's stay here for a moment. Slowly build the spine up, hands to the knee. Find that balance and control. Two arms up, breathe in. Exhale, squeeze the shoulder blades together as you broaden the collarbones. Woo inhale, reach, and exhale. One more time, inhale, reach, and exhale. Open the arms to the sides. Gentle twist towards your right now as you reach from arm to arm. Keep some support through the belly. Inhale, get a little bit taller. Exhale, maybe you twist a little bit more. Good, two arms up. And then we'll bring the hands down. Let's step that right foot back. Once again, let's bring the hands um, and under the shoulders, step the feet back, send your hips up and back, find that down dog, taking a breath in. Let's exhale, wave the spine forward, squeeze the glutes, hold that plank. And then send your hips back again, inhale. Exhale, wave your spine forward, find that plank, glutes are on. One more time, send your body back. And wave it forward. The knees are going to come down. You're going to face the side of your mat, finding sort of like that pretzel-like position with your legs. And you're going to begin by taking your um, left hand out to the side. Sweep your right arm up as you lift your hips, finding a bit of a stretch through the whole body, side body, and bring it back down. And same thing, sweep the arm, inhale. And exhale, bring it down and sweep it up and lower it. Your knees are staying down on the mat. Two more times like that. Breathe in and breathe out. And one more time. Breathe in and breathe out. Staying right here, right hand towards the leg, left arm lifts, find length and over any amount. We'll stay here for two long breaths. 
opening up the sides of the ribs, focusing the breath into the side body. Beautiful, and bring it all the way back. Good, lean back into your hands, and then just let your legs sway a little from side to side here. Windshield wipe, bring the legs here. Good. And then we're gonna flip them the other way. So I've got my right leg in front, left leg back. My right arm is gonna, right hand is gonna reach to the floor. I'm gonna sweep the left arm up as I press my hips up, breathe in. And then as I exhale, I'll bring it all back down. And up again for two. And lower. Sweep up for three. And bring it down. Sweep up for four. My knees are staying down. My shoulder is steady. Good. And then I'll stay here. Left hand on the leg. Right arm re li lifts your to reach up to go over. And again, focusing that attention and concentration of breath through the right side of the ribs. As you breathe in, notice the ribs gently moving out. And as you breathe out, notice the ribs gently coming in. And one last breath here. And bring it all back up. Good. Once again, let's lean back and just send this way the hips a bit from side to side. Good. And then I'm just going to adjust my position so that my knees are still bent, feet are flat. Arms are going to come out in front. Breathe in. I'm going to grow tall. Exhale. We're going to curl. Two, three. Roll back up. Two, three. Exhale. Curl. Two, three. Inhale. Roll up. Two, three. Exhale. Let's curl. Two, three. Inhale. Roll up. Two, three. Exhale. Curl. Two, three. Inhale, roll up. This time we're going to transition down. Exhale to curl. Two, three. Keep going. Four and five. All the way down onto your back. Good. Bring the heels a little closer. Inhale. Exhale. Press into the feet. Imprint the low spine. Peel the hips to your bridge. Breathe in here. Squeeze the glutes. Lengthen the front of the thighs. Exhale. Soften the chest. Take the arms up. Start to reach them back as your spine rolls down. Breathe in. Exhale, peel the body up as your arms reach and press them into the ground as you press the hips up. Roll the spine down as you reverse. And exhale, let's peel up. Inhale. Exhale, roll down. Bone by bone, take as much time as you need. Inhale. Exhale, let's peel up. Press into the feet. Inhale. Exhale, rolling down. Two, three. Last one like this. Breathe in. Breathe out as you peel the spine up. Inhale, press into the hands and roll down. Two, three. Let's take the elbows um, to like a cactus position if that feels great or out to the side. Step the feet a bit wider. Both knees fall to one side as you inhale. And back through center, other way. So we're finding a little bit more ability in the hips here. Maybe a stretch through the front of each hip. Inhale. Exhale as the legs come through center. Inhale. Exhale. And I'm reaching a little bit with my knee as I reach long rather than down. And again, good. This next time when both knees make it over to the right, I'm gonna bring my hands behind my head. I'm gonna slide my left leg on top of my right and roll my body to my side. Good, so my legs are stacked, arms are stacked. Then I'm gonna keep my legs stacked. I'm just gonna open the chest as I breathe in. And then exhale, turn it back in. And open the chest, inhale, and exhale. One more time, inhale, and I'm going to stay here, getting a little bit of an expansion through the ribs. Let my shoulders soften. 
Really good. Then I'm gonna stay open with my chest, just slide that left leg back. Both knees face the ceiling, both knees fall to the left. Slide the right leg over on top, turn my body over. And then again, inhale, open the chest. Exhale, close. Inhale, open. And exhale, close. Last time, open. And we'll stay here for a few more breaths. Expanding into the hips and ribs. Shoulder girdle. Let's do one more cycle of breath there. And then go ahead, slide that right foot back, roll the body back to center. From here, just take the legs in towards your chest, give yourself a hug. And we are done. That is our 15 minute flow. Very quick and easy just to get you started for the day. Stay here as long as you like. And um, I hope to see you again for a few more of my fabulous, February's Fabulous 15. See you, bye.